Hey y'all, I am the Creative Lady, aka Nebulicious TV. In today's video, I had to catch myself because I was about to take all of my trucks down and rearrange them yet again. But I remembered that I had a question from someone who wanted to know two things. A, how many pairs of trucks do I own? I don't know, but I will let you know at the end of the video. And B, how do I store them? So let me answer the second part first. I use this shelving system from Ikea and I'll show it to you in just a second and it works for me. It's very budget friendly and it allows me to easily store my chucks. It kind of forces me to have enough room for the type that I have. Like in here, I could put high or low, but here I can only put the low chuck. So I have to make sure that when I am ordering that I am able to store them properly because I don't want to have chucks all over the house, okay? I have to contain my shoe hoarding, okay? So I'll answer the questions at the end of the video. Hold on and let me show you what this looks like up close. Okay, this is the actual shelf that I'm using from Ikea. It's the Mac Macapar, item number 203-362-33. It's very inexpensive and you see how it looks when it's put together. You get uh storage on top storage in the middle and depending on how you store it storage on the bottom but this is the bottom middle and top and of course i've got a lot of shoes to put back even though that's not everything so i'm gonna take it up a couple more shelves and then come back and show you how many i have okay okay y'all i am back i have just finished reorganizing and rearranging first of all the shelves because i had to take them all apart and then put them together upside down because I could not get it through the door because I kind of added some yeah some height so I had to take everything apart and then put it back together and then take the you know put the shoes back on and then I'm trying to organize them but I pretty much got all of my shoes that are in stock on this shelf that are converts I got other shoes oh my gosh got other shoes but as I was filming the, the initial part of this video, I thought, oh, wait a minute. Let me go look in here because I think I got some in there that I never wore. So I've got hoarder issues with Converse. I got a few pair that I have not worn. I see three that I had to go over there and get to add to the video because I had left them in another part of the house and have not worn them. And then I've got a couple few pair back here that I have not worn yet. And then I have two new pair on the way. So I love Chucks and I've told y'all why I wear them. But in case you don't know, I wear them because I'm a librarian and I run around the building all day long. And it kind of, I can't wear cute shoes and clothes. I could, but Converse gives me a daily, you know, dose of, okay, something different just about every day. And I'm not worried about, you know, trying to wear, you know, fashionable clothing. The chucks speak for me. But anywho, let's get on into the count so that I can get Crystal off of my asking me every day. Okay, and then I'll let you know how many pairs that I have. So let's get to counting. All right, hold on. Okay, y'all, okay, we're back. Let's start counting. Now, you'll see these orange boxes here the black boxes they're all empty but you'll see the pair up by where up at the very very top there's only one pair up there all the other boxes up there are empty so that's the bling dot pair that my fairy godmother sent to me i'm not, not going to count that right now because we're just going to move down on each of the shelves there are pretty much four pairs on the shelves but we're going to just start counting because some shelves have a little space for clothes. Haha. <laughs> okay, so on the second shelf, we got one pair. Okay, one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. Twenty, twenty one. 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 
40, 41, 42, plus the pair that my favorite godmother sent me. What is that? 43? Up there, that makes 43. Plus this other three boxes that I've got to add. And we're going to share them together. But before I do that, there's some more pair up here that I have not worn. So let me pull the ones that I have not worn. These, I've worn those. Let's see. Okay, these right here. I have not worn these. Matter of fact, it still got the tag on it. These are the ones I ordered about last Christmas. No, thank you. Know, Black Friday. Uh, I think that was Black Friday 2018. Okay. They were sent to my aunt's house and it took me a long time to get to them. But these are like a micro suede. They aren't as purpley as I wanted them to be, but I like them. But I just don't have the right outfit to wear with them. So I can wear like all black or all white or something like that. But yeah, kind of hard to match this particular color of purple, shade of purple. Um, Let's see. So that's one pair. Okay, here's another pair. These are like neon highlighter pink. I have not worn them. And they have a bright yellow bottom. I love these. I have not worn them because, again, it's kind of hard to coordinate with them. So that's what, two pair that I have not worn. Hmm, I've worn all of those. Of course, you've seen these right here. And I have a video where I show you guys on my other channel how I customize those. So I haven't worn those a couple times. Oh, I've forgotten about these, y'all. These are some high top purple and gold chucks. I have not worn them. So that's what, three pair that I have not worn yet. Here's another pair I have not worn. These are the, the Krugly ones. So this makes about, what, four? I plan to wear them this week. You know, I love, I have an affinity and affection, a love for purple, even if it's Krugly, okay, and Converse. So, you know, it's a win, win, win for me. So I have not worn these, so let's see. Have I worn these? Mm, yeah, I've worn these. But these are those. I, and I'll link my playlist above for my chucks. I've done about two or three videos. Mm, let's see. Have I, yeah, I've worn these. These are the ones in red. I needed a red pair. I waited so long to get a red pair. I've worn those. Have I worn these? I don't think I have not worn these. Okay, and these are black and white geometric. These are my babies. I love them, wear them every day. I finally got a chance to wear these. These are like golden girl, all corn golden girl shoes. I've worn them. Everything down here has been worn. This is another customized pair. This has got my chapter name, if you haven't seen them. But yeah, I've got a, a video. If you can, I think I got yeah, all of them on there. So I've worn all of these down here. These are my go-tos. So definitely. The little janky here, you know, look, I'm supposed to make sure that it's not wobbly. There are no kids in here, but if you have a shelf like this, you might have to make sure that you anchor it, okay? So let me turn now and come back and let's unbox these other three shoes. Okay, y'all, here we are with the three boxes that I have not worn. I'm actually going to show them to you. Okay, this is one pair high tops and these are the i think they're called the cowgirl or something like that western inspired i have not worn these but i definitely will wear them very very soon so that's one pair okay y'all okay pardon the janky because i don't have my tripod i was not expecting to have to be over on this side oh <laughs> Ooh, i forgot about these okay here's another pair these are i guess like zebra they're like a cream and black High top chucks. Have I worn these? I don't think so. No. So I can wear these again with, you know, particular items. But yes, I got these. And these were all like $25 back around the, I don't know when. But I did do a haul of them. I did haul them, but I just did not um, put them in the collection because they had gotten a little out of control for storage. And yeah, here's my last pair. So let's speak together because I promise you, I don't know what pair this is. It feels kind of like, let's see together. What is this? Oh, okay. This is one of those, um, I don't know what it's called, but it's like a metallic rainbow -ish shoe. It's not the pride shoe, but it's just a metallic rainbow metallic -y shoe. I will definitely wear this very, very soon. So, that's everything in my collection. And I will put the final count of the number of Converse that I have in stock. And I'll include the two that's on the way. So, that'll give you 
my chuck count so it's going to be right here the number that i have 